The London Academy of Excellence Tottenham is a partnership between Highgate School as the principal education sponsor and Tottenham Hotspur Football Club as a business sponsor to open a rigorous academic selective 16 to 19 free school in the heart of Tottenham. Highgate's support as principal education sponsor is to provide five full-time equivalent teachers, therefore providing young people with the same opportunities to achieve the best possible grades and the opportunities to go on to top competitive universities and employment beyond. The entire culture of the organisation will be not only to push them academically hard, but to develop their personal skills, to develop their confidence and to develop their resilience. Welcome. For those of you who I haven't met, my name is Mr Ballon and I am the principal designate of the LA Tottenham. If you are interested in doing difficult A-level courses which help you get into a top university and top employment beyond, that is what we are aiming to do. It's basically a free school but same education as a private school. So I found, I found that really interesting and fun. Before we existed, only three uh, children from Newham each year went to Oxford and Cambridge, and about 60 or 70 went off to Russell Group Universities each year. Then what you do, you measure some hydrogen peroxide, in the measuring cylinder you take 20 centimetres cubed. Last summer, LAE alone sent six of its students off to Oxford and Cambridge, and 123 went to Russell Group Universities. In their first week of study with us, all of our students will visit Oxford University as a symbol of the kind of place which we're aiming for all of them to reach during their time with us. I'll be around people who have like the same aspirations as me, who want to like get A stars and A's, who want to go to like the best universities. It will be quite nice to be around those kinds of people to maybe push me further. I'd say that maths A-level, if you're good at maths, it's kind of comfortably challenging. What we see with a lot of the most motivated and aspirational young people is their ambitions are to do with professions, their ambitions are to do with medicine, their ambitions are to do with law, their ambitions are to do with engineering. Although we support those ambitions and absolutely we're set up to, to help those students to get into top universities to study those courses, at the same time our responsibility is to give them a wider picture of the opportunities that are available. Having arrived at Highgate as Director of Art um, and been in that position for five years, I am now in, right in the middle of doing my um, MA in Fine Art at Chelsea College of Art, as well as teaching part-time at Highgate. Um, but now I have this incredible new challenge ahead of setting up the new art department at Tottenham in the most wonderful building. My mind is alive with the possibilities of ideas of installations and collaborative work and sculptures and films and projections and um, I think we're, we're going to have a lot of fun. For success at sixth form you need to be taught by someone with a strong academic background, someone who knows their subject inside out and someone who is passionate about their subject and Highgate teachers tick all of those boxes. I'm hugely excited about what the staff from Highgate can provide and equally excited about maybe some of the lessons that can be learnt for those staff and for young people at Highgate from the hunger and the determination of the young people that we will have in Tottenham. What we do in the classroom is not enough to get our A's and A stars to get into the top universities. We need to put in that extra effort and that extra reading before lessons and after lessons and the people that come here don't need the teachers to tell them that, they do it themselves. Why mind to overlap? That idea as a whole would be self-actualisation. I think they usually put it in as acceptance in there. Okay. So if I were to go back to my old secondary school, I don't think I could have imagined myself having um, discussions about religion, about the LGD LGBT community because there just wasn't a sphere for it. But here, because I'm surrounded by new people, people who come from different backgrounds, different religions, different cultures, to have different opinions and different perceptions just really opens up your mind. The educational landscape in um, Harringay is very, very similar to that of Newham four or five years ago. And I think um, the impact that LAE will have on that borough, um, I can see being, uh, you know, the same or even greater than LAE has had in Stratford and in Newham more widely. I feel you know, very proud to be part of an initiative like this that is really helping and supporting and providing alternative methods, methods that work. I think it's incredibly exciting and I, I really want to be part of it. 
I think being the first cohort and being able to achieve what they did in Stratford would be a big achievement, not only for teachers but the students, and being able to get into Russell Group Universities and to help Tottenham get out of that 1%, I think that would be a big achievement for everyone, including the first cohort. <laughs> yeah. Highgate is not doing any of this support for LAE Tottenham from a sense of a minimum of support to maintain charitable status. They're making a significant impact, they're taking a significant risk with their teaching staff and their reputation to help young people to achieve as best as they possibly can.